I'm Redneck Computer Geek. Today Johnny's helping me with this unboxing video. And what this is, is this is the Impact Implement Time Plow. It's item number IP5562. Now, what this is going on is my GT6000. It's going to be my next mud mower build. And we also intend to go and have it as a utility vehicle for our homesteading needs. I'm going to be building a one point hitch, a implement lifting hitch on it also and I'll be following that up with another video that this is going to be put on to. Two acre homestead that we're working on and we've got a third of a mile long driveway. So this is definitely going to see quite a bit of, a, quite a bit of use. This is a heavy box. It says that it's 40 pounds and it is every single bit of 40 pounds. Yeah. So, when you get it shipped, expect them to throw it out of the vehicle and just leave it wherever it is. You can order it on Amazon. It's about $105, $110. It seems to shift quite often. I'll post a link down in the description. So, let's cut it open. Let's see what's in the package. Yep. I don't know what's in the package. You don't know what's in the package? Do you? Oh, do I? I'm pretty sure that it's a time plow, considering that's what it says on the front. Okay, I open it. Oh, you're going to help me open it? Okay, wait, 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 wait. We're going to flip it over and let the people see. Ready? And up goes the box. Oh, wow. So here we are. You can see the actual backing for it. This is where the hitch pin ends up going in, and it comes across, and these are the tines, and we're going to pull the rest apart and see what it takes to put it back together. So apparently Johnny, in digging around in the box, discovered that this is basically all you get for directions. Hi, so I was really impressed with the thickness here, so I wanted to show it to everybody. If you can see this, they're actually over a quarter inch thick. They're 5 16 thick. And for the Canadian viewers, they're actually about 8 millimeter. So just under a centimeter thick. And the actual implement bar itself is actually made out of almost almost quarter inch thick and for the Canadians that's about 0.5 centimeters so it's really good high quality thick steel I was very impressed with that fact alright so at this point I've come to the conclusion that using a table like this is probably the easiest way to install these on either side these are 14 millimeter with the lock nut going on the bottom and the washer going on bottom. So we're going to take the tine, we're going to put it through, drop the bolt in, flip it, put a washer in, and put a lock nut. And from there, go down through and do the rest. Like I said, 14 millimeter on both sides. So here's the unit entirely assembled. And it's extremely solid. Definitely happy with the purchase. As you can see here though, I did notice one thing about this. That for some reason, some of the tongs, see the space there, no space, no space, no space, no space, slight space. Some of the tongs are a little bit longer than the others. How that's going to affect it in usage, we'll see. Give me a like, comment down below. If you happen to like the video, subscribe. I got more coming.